Hello and welcome to our channel. Now this video will tell you how the cars of Once Upon a Time in the West 1968 has changed. I'll show you what they looked like back then in 1968 and now in 2022 how they changed compared to when they were in this movie. Alright, let's go! Charles Bronson in the movie he plays harmonica. In 1968, he was 47 years old and it was with great sadness that Bronson passed away at the age of 81 on August 30th, 2003. Inside the dusters, there were three men. So? Inside the men, there were three bullets. In those days, they received two dollars for every man they caught in the freight yards. And the uh, justice of the peace would receive two dollars for sentencing. It was that kind of thing. Henry Fonda in the movie, he plays Frank. In 1968, he was 63 years old and it was with great sadness that Fonda died at his home in Los Angeles on August 12, 1982, of heart disease. He was 77 years old. It's almost like holding a gun. Only much more powerful. Work with some of the best producers, best directors, best writers, best actors in motion pictures. Gabriel Fazzetti in the movie he plays Morton, Railroad Baron. In 1968, he was 43 years old, and it was with great sadness that Fazzetti passed away on December 2nd, 2015, at the age of 90. And can you tell me what good was your stupid massacre? <laughs> now a Mrs. McBain is turned up. Un passant. Secondo lei il motivo perché mancano gli attori bravi o mancano le sceneggiature belle? Forse mancano le sceneggiature e mancano i signori che amino. Claudia Cardinal in the movie she plays Jill McBain. In 1968 she was 30 years old and now she's 84 years old. Of course I have. I'm here alone in the hands of a bandit who smelled money. If you want to, you can lay me over the table and amuse yourself. Il y avait toujours quelqu'un qui m'appelait et je répondais au téléphone et qui hurlait « Maman, maman !» Moi, je me disais « Ce fou, je m'étais toujours... » Puis après, j'ai découvert que c'était lui, quoi. <rire> lui, c'était un... Jack Elam, in the movie, he plays the role of Snakey. He was 48 years old in 1968, and it was with great sadness that Elam died of congestive heart failure in Ashland, Oregon, in 2003, age 82. Pop that you won or lost? No, you, only, you could only win the bill. Oh, you, see, yeah, but you play a large poker, you can win that hundred dollars. Right. Or oh, the biggest, the most I ever won, one day I know on uh, the gun smoke, I did about 25 gun smokes, the guest shots. Paolo Stoppa, in the movie, he plays Sam. In 1968, he was 62 years old, and it was with great sadness that he passed away on May the 1st, 1988, at the age of 81. McBean! Yeah, sure. That stubborn, red-headed Irishman killing Stan for years way out there in the middle of nowhere. Evidentemente è stato deposto e sistemato così dopo la morte per farlo trovare a lei nel suo letto. Frank Wolf in the movie he plays Brad McBain. In 1968, he was 40 years old and it was with great sadness that he passed away on December 12, 1971 at the age of 43. Soon you can cut the bread in slices as big as a door if you want to. You'll have beautiful new clothes, and you won't have to work no more. Now take it easy. When we go to town tomorrow, you yourself can take Mr. Egan a truce proposition. Thank you, Uncle. I adore you. Only because I love people. Cannon Wynn in the movie he plays sheriff and auctioneer. In 1986, he was 52 years old and it was with great sadness that Wynn contracted pancreatic cancer, which caused him to die on October 14, 1986, at the age of 70. I'm sorry, Mrs. McBain, but I think I'm gonna have to knock down on that last bid. I would say the first 10 minutes of the picture, I would assume that there might be four lines. All I can tell you is I was on the picture for seven months. Leonor Stander in the movie he plays Barman. 
He was 60 years old in 1968, and it was with great sadness that Stander died of lung cancer in Los Angeles, California in 1994 at the age of 86. Well, I'd like to use the same facilities you people do. You sure can. Just have to have a full tub in the back. And you're lucky only three people have used it this morning. Leonard Goldberg, Tom Mankiewicz, Mark Crowley, and particularly Robert Wagner and Stephanie Powers. Woody Strode in the movie he plays Tony. In 1968, he was 54 years old, and it was with great sadness that he passed away on December 31st, 1994 at the age of 80. Jason Roberts in the movie he plays Manuel Cheyenne Gutierrez. In 1968, he was 46 years old, and it was with great sadness that he passed away from lung cancer in Bridgeport, Connecticut on December 26, 2000, age 78. And a fired up Cheyenne. Ain't a nice thing to see. Especially for a lady. Thanks for watching the whole video. If you like this video, please share it, don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel to support us in producing the next video.